walk into this. It's much better than being out in the sun. 27 degrees for the middle of May. All right. Uh, how's my levels? Are they too high, too low? Oh, that's only normal speaking. But if I get higher, how is that? All right. Excellent. I, I personally, I'd prefer it if you didn't. <laughs> Thanks, mate. I say personally, um, <laughs> who does <has> football <laughs> might not like your view. <laughs>
To Hills Football Premier League men's coverage of round six. The match of the day here at Valentine Sports Park is Castle Hill RSL Rockets up against the Kenhurst Bush Boys. Dave McVillan will bring you all the action here from a very warm Glenwood. Valentine Sports Park, of course, the home of Football New South Wales. It's Kenhurst who are the home side today. Let's have a look at how they line up. Starting within goals, number 21, Joseph Yameen. Number four, Ian Farrell. Number nine, Jordan Bonello. Number 10, former Hills United, Blacktown City player, Peter Checker. Number 11, Matthew Leroy. Number 12, Paul Tassis. Number 13, Edward Rinaldi. Number 16, Daniel Vukovic. Number 17, Matthew Geeky. Number 19, Owen Littlewood. And number 33 is Alex Torval. While the Rockets... Also on 10 points along with Kenthurst. Now they're actually sitting in second on goal difference. They line up today. Number one, Anthony Cassatini. Number 11, Samuel Hamilton. Number 14, Connor Overton. Number 18, Rob Polistina. Number 21, Francesco Terranova. Number 22, Matthew Tuma. Number 23, Sean Overton. 26, Mahmoud Hosseini. Number 41, Kazim Bangash. Number 49 goes to Sama, and 45 is Pasquale Polistina. And Castle Hill RSL Rockets will defend the left side of your screen. White shirts, blue shorts, and the Bush Boys defending the northern end or the right of your screen in their traditional red strip. I know it seems crazy that most games within Hills football have been washed out this weekend and we are baking in 27 degrees of sunshine. It's hard to imagine, but we're getting a game away here. And for those that are interested, the reserve grade match went the way of Kenthurst, two goals to one. That'll be the dangerous Sama to start us off here. For the Rockets. And we're away. Round six. Hills football. Premier League men's match of the day. And it'll be the Rockets to start off in possession. As I mentioned, both teams. Two wins and a draw. With two goals. The difference between the sides. And he played three, of course, it's a, been a bit of a mess with all these washouts and replays. The, the Rockets to get the throw from just deep in their half. 
We saw drinks break in the first match because it is very warm. We may see the same today. Quite a bit of fire in the reserve grade match. Let's see if we see the same today. A nice little flick back from Polistina. And the switch might be intercepted here. Tassis was quick, but not quick enough for Hosseini. Bangash. Skipper Sean Overton will find his brother, Connor. A little bit heavy touch. Bonello wins it. Ball from Checker. Will he find Bonello? He won't. Overton clears. Hopefully he can stay fit. Checker is a dangerous player, we all know. Kenthurst on the attack and Bonello again heading to the line. Connor Overton in front of him, who defends very well. Turns the ball over. Polistina. Rob, that is. A couple of pairs of brothers in this Rockets team. Leroy with the cutout. A little flick here, but well read by the Rockets. Unfortunately, Hamilton's touch was just too heavy. Leroy. Sure, if he had his time over again. Bonello, he might have thought of something different there. Space in the middle there for Bangash. A little bit of time on the ball here for Rockets. And they go long. It's over the head of Hamilton. And Yamin will get his first touch of the day. And in no hurry. As he urges his defence to push up further. Flick on from Checker, not a bad one. But again, the Rockets have their structure to deal with that. Clearance finds Kenthurst, and they win possession back. Checker, again, just couldn't hold that. But Kenthurst keep possession through a throw. Geeky. We're able to close down the space, but still able to get the ball away. Rockets, but it, sorry, uh, Kenthurst. But again, just a little heavy touch. Rockets well positioned. All right. There was a catch-up game during the week, which we'll touch on in a minute, because that's a nice little flick over from Bonello. Leroy to the line. De the cross is deflected. It's spun nearly over the top of Cassantini. That was dangerous. That was a vicious Nathan Lyon off-break. <laughs> well won by Bonello. Check has got two in front of him. Happy to go back. Kendurst now happy to use the space. Geeky. Bonello. Bonello looks up and has a shot. Not a bad attempt. Curled away at the end. Kenthurst starting reasonably strongly here. Castle Hill RSL Rockets trying hard to find a way out of their own area. Ball through. Could be onside. Uh, totally was onside too. Wonderful move, Kenthurst. Still danger for the Rockets here. 
Vukovic gets it back to Guki. Peter Checker turns. He'll have a shot. Drills it into his own player. Castle RSL able to escape. And they get some ball in the opposition half. But Leroy does well. Nobody gave Toomer a call. Rob Polistina. Good Sama. Nice touch. Chance for RSL. Toomer's shot. Did not have much power behind it. I mentioned earlier, Sam is very dangerous. Not only can he bang them away. He's pretty handy on the assist. Now, that will go out. Very healthy crowd here at Valentine Sports Park this afternoon too, I must add. Only a couple of hundred here. Now, that's a poor turnover to Rinaldi. Rinaldi to the line. Rinaldi will concede the goal kick. A couple of shouts for a corner. Casentini with the clearance. Sama tries to bring it down. Nearly earns the deflection. Now he's onside. Good ball from Hamilton. Steps around Torville. Gets a ball in. Littlewood was right where he needed to be. Sama with a volley. No problems for Yamin. First shot. For the Rockets. So the other games that were scheduled today, again, I, can't, I presume and cannot 100% confirm, they were washed out. We'll come back because Bonello nearly found a way through into the area. Connor Overton did well. So the schedule for today was Rouse Hill Rams at home to Winston Hills. Borkham Hills at home to Kellyville Colts and Kellyville United at home to Norwest. And Castle Hill United the bye. Now a few clubs are now having to chase up a few matches. We'll have a look at that in a moment. But Bonello with Overton. Not cleared. Leroy into the middle. Checker couldn't control. Brought down. Can they get a shot? Yes, they can. But straight into the arms of Cassantini. Matthew Geeky that came in through the middle. Kendo's on the attack again. Now it was a heavy touch. Keeper does well. Rocket still under pressure in their own back third. The switch of play is intercepted. But Benello's touch was too heavy. And that'll be a free kick. Given away by Vukovic. I'm sure my eyes didn't deceive me, but there was a round one catch-up match that occurred on Wednesday night. Castle Hill RSL 7, Winston Hills 5. So unless the website is wrong, that was an absolute goal fest during the week. Sama, nice touch. Polistina on the turn. Rob, he's blocked and a free kick's given. Farrell concedes just outside the area. So not a bad opportunity here for Castle Hill RSL. Literally a metre and a half outside the area. So Sama and Matthew Toomer over the ball. Just over 10 minutes gone. No score here. Kent Hurst and Castle Hill RSL. Summer. Looks like he will be the taker. But it's a fake. Toomer's ball goes wide and high.
And it was supposed to be another catch-up match tomorrow. Round two catch-up match between Winston Hills and Borkham Hills. Again, that may have to be postponed again. Now Bob free in the middle here. Was Geeky with a nice ball, but just one step ahead was Cassantini. That's deflected off Geeky, so it'll be an RSL ball. Hills football history buffs. Wonder if anyone can name what Castle Hill RSL Rockets were called before they changed their name to what they currently are. We'll come back to that because another move with Leroy. Deflection off Sama. Fortuitous for RSL. That was in the back. Referee Dab does not have a problem with that. It'll be a throw. If my memory serves me correct, they certainly weren't blue and white and, and the orange that they currently are. A long time ago they changed their name. But Sama made the run, but well blocked. Bobukovic now, Peter Checker is bumped off the ball. Should have been a foul, not given. Another one not given. Into the area is Hamilton. Hamilton with the shot. Sama, oh, he's fluffed it from point black range. Right on the six yard line. He's just had to tap it in. And now oh, he's looking to the sky because he scores some crackers. But that should have been 1 0 to Castle Hill RSL. Uh, definitely the best chance so far. I mean, it's just over 13 minutes in this round six match of the day here on Hills Football Premier League. Leroy again coming up to do some work with Benello. Benello beats one, beats two into the area. Ball's deflected. Can they get a shot on? The shot's blocked. Ronaldi couldn't control. Now Rockets look to go. Ball was intercepted by Torval. Torval's got space. Check up. Again, double teamed. Now a little bit of space here for Castle Hill on the left-hand side. Ball comes to Sama. If he can control there, could be some trouble. Leroy takes the safe option. So Castle RSL now. With their first corner. Oh, they've now found their way twice in behind the Kenthurst defence. Corner about to come in to the six yard. Kent Hurst get the first touch. Turn over for a little bit of a dart. Ch chance to shoot. Great shot. Well saved by Yamin. Still not out of danger for Kent Hurst. Checker, strong. So having a good run here. Pasquale Polistina, the sniper, has just got Matt Geeky. And the result will be a corner. And it's now Castle RSL with a little bit of possession. In Kenthurst half. It looks like That might be Overton there. That'll take it from the northwestern corner. Comes to Sa oh, Sama was in a good position, but an even better position was Littlewood. 
Final bit of defence. The shot causes no problems. And both goals remain intact. 16 minutes gone. No score, but bo chances at both ends. Not a bad ball if he can bring it under control. It was a tough one too. Bangash finds Rob Polistina. Sama. Right idea. Just half a pace behind was Polistina. Now Leroy. Got some work to do. Nearly a high foot. But he is a very tall man, Sama. Vukovic finds some space. Oh, they just can't keep possession. Pasquale Polistina offside. The assistant referee has picked that one up. Who you may just have seen her in an article. On Hills football. Uh, you mean we'll take the free kick. It's over the head of the defender. Comes down for checkup. Place square to Vukovic. It was uh, Ronaldi with that ball in and comes all the way back. And used Leroy but didn't read the return. And Sama with the ball. Now that's going to almost fall fortuitously for Tuma. But Kenthurst lucky they have numbers back. Pasquale Polistina. Going around in circles. Castle Hill able to get out of the tight space. Long range shot. And I tell you what, not a bad one whatsoever from Rob Polistina. Did make you mean have to work. Just a little bit hard to tell from where we are here whether that was directly in. Appeals for a free kick. Nothing doing there. No. That's... That was good defence, but again, plenty of white shirts around. Rob Polistina. Pressure from RSL. Peter Checkers had to come back, and he finds a ball over the top to Paul Tassis, who's in a race with Hosseini. Hosseini will earn the throw. Clearance only goes as far as Kenthurst, but they've turned it over. Sama, if he can bring it down, he will most likely find a teammate, which he did, but that was given away. It'll be now Kenthurst's turn. Vukovic was trying to send Benello on a run down the flank. Back to Leroy again. And holding their shape well, RSL here. Check up. Benello. Goes for the switch. It's probably going to be too heavy. A little bit ambitious. A little bit too much to ask of Paul Tassis. Be a goal kick. We've just gone 20 minutes gone here. Who've just joined us. It's been chances at both ends. James right, just starting to open up a little bit. So it's rather warm here today. 
It's going to take a toll out of the players throughout the afternoon. Wet, miserable weather to 27 degrees and sunny. Geeky did well to win it, but it was, again, dispossessed. That's very often that's happened today for both sides. Opportunity here for RSL. They've scored. Samuel Hamilton with a fine finish. Kenhurst caught off guard. And Hamilton has buried the game's opener. Castle Hill, RSL 1, Kenhurst nil. So the referee has called a drinks break as predicted. A perfect opportunity. So oh. it was all Kenthurst for the first 10. Rockets got their way back in and they are now in the lead. Uh, don't forget tomorrow, 3 p.m., the women's match of the day from the same location here at Football New South Wales headquarters. Let's hope the weather gives us another cracker like they've given today. Look back to last week's results. Round five. There was one washout. So the scores were Car uh, Castle Hill RSL. 3-1 winners over Kellyville United. The two-all draw between the Rams of Rouse Hill and the Kellyville Colts. And in the match of the day here last weekend, it was Castle Hill United 2, Winston Hills 3. Interesting way the comp is starting to shape up. Norwest currently on top with 12. Rockets and Kenthurst on 10. Castle Hill United on 8. They are the only team to have played five matches. And we're down to the Colts on 7. Winston Hills 6. Rams 4. Kellyville United 3. And Borkham Hills have not registered a point yet. Drop ball, and Kenthurst will keep possession through Leroy. Now Kenthurst, what will their reply be? Going over the top again. This time, Torville will keep it in. Tassis is there. Geeky looks up. Can he find a way through? He, he nearly did. So there was Ronaldi right on the spot. And Bonello at the far post. The throw to Ronaldi. Possible accidental elbow there. Oh, the ball to Checker wasn't a good one. Now, on the break here is Castle Aracel. Offside, though. Oh, it's a shame if he'd looked to the right. Summer was onside. Right, that could have been trouble for Kent Hurst. Take him quickly. Ronaldi and Vukovic couldn't win out there. They do well to find Polistina, Castle Hill RSL. Tuma chasing it down, but Farrell will cover it easily. Well, 
Nice touch to Vukovic. And gets it back. Vukovic got Sama coming. Wrong option. Sama very strong. Oh. Another turnover. Peter Checker. Good work from Ronaldi to find Torval. This is better from Kenthurst. Ronaldi. Ronaldi with the shot and save from Cassettini. Oh, he made him work hard, did he? Ronaldi. He was at full stretch. And he's kept the Rockets goal intact. Cassantini. Flick on from Checker. Now from Sama, who gets a return flick on. Hamilton is running through, but he could not get the angle to bring the ball around. And now, as I said, it's opened up a bit. And here is Kenthurst straight back into the opposition half. Again, just the, some of the short touches going astray. Cross in Bangash now with some space. Connor Overton. Bangash. Nice ball to Polistina. Polistina gets the rebound. Oh, Saba! Avoid oh, another volley! Oh, that would have put the dagger into the hearts of the Kenthurst fans. But quality work from Rob Polistina. His first ball was blocked. He got the return. And a perfect delivery in there. And score still right. It's still 1-0. Easily could have been two then. Now, some more space for Rob Polistina. Tuma looks to shoot on target. Not enough power, though. That's a big clearance. It's over everybody. And falling for Rinaldi, if he can keep it. He earns the free kick. He's caught. Well, instigating a step over. So Kenthurst now. Their first dead ball opportunity up here in quite a while. And can the Bush boys claw one back here? So Rockets have got all but one in the area. Delivery comes in. It's beaten everybody. That might be a corner because I think it's off a Rockets defender. Oh, it might have been Connor. It was Connor Overton. It's come off. And again, not easy from that side where he was looking into the sun. Ronaldi with the corner. Far post. Kenos get a hand on it via Geeky, but he's unable to bring it down. And it'll be another goal kick. I mean, it's almost the end of female football week. There's been some wonderful coverage this week across all the social media at Hills Football and Hills Football Premier League. So please don't forget to get behind the Women's Premier League tomorrow. Strong work from Farrell.
Courageous work from Hosseini. Quarter buzz here at Valentine Sports Park. Very good crowd. Bukovic loses out. Trouble. That's strong. That is quality defense from Owen Littlewood. And it hasn't got up to him. We'll come back to that in a moment. That's a wonderful ball. Can they finish? They can! Edward Rinaldi. The Bush boys are back. It's one all. And when they put some touches together, they're dangerous. Where that started was all through the strong challenge from Littlewood at the back. Had he not made that challenge, RSL would have been on the attack and definitely a chance of getting towards the area. But we're all square. 1-1. One, one. Plenty more left in this one. We've got 12 and a half minutes to go in this first half. Check out uh, his ball that he received was a little strong. He did well to get something on it. Bangash. Ball's out though. Assistant picks that one up quick, quickly. Well, there's substitution. Now, I think we might have a problem here for Hamilton. Just reconfirm that is him. Yes, it is. I'll find you the substitution in just a moment. Why not? What? Castle Hill RSL needed to lose their goal scorer. That's a nice ball over to Bonello. Bonello, oh, just a heavy touch. He was lining up to shoot. Good work in defence from Castle Hill RSL. Jaden Galanos in 46 is the substitute. Oh, now to the line. Summers in the middle. Littlewood covers. Kenthurst clear. Palestina. Touch is too heavy. It'll be a goal kick. Also tomorrow, at one fifteen is the community round match. Uh, which I believe is all age ladies too. So that match will be on before the Premier League match of the day tomorrow. Good initiative from Hills Football. Great to see some other teams apart from the Premier League getting a look in on the big screen. Be a free kick on the far side. Slowly bring it out and go over the top, but a little bit ambitious. There's no way Ronaldi could bring that one in. Sama nearly gave away a free kick. Ronaldi again. He loses it, and here's Sama who needs support. 
Bangash. Sama. Stayed in. That's a lovely ball to Pasquale Polistina. Right, try to split two. He had Bangash free behind him. Just trying to get out of their area. Benello's square ball is intercepted. That's a strong challenge from Geeky. Nothing wrong with it though. Free kick inside the centre circle. We're coming up to eight minutes remaining in this first half. just joined us Samuel Hamilton that opened the scoring for the Castle RSL Rockets the 22nd minute oh good dummy from Checker just wasn't read by his teammate and then 32nd minute Edward Ronaldi another good finish see the Bush boys level it up here at Valentine Sports Park Chip over the top's too big for Sama. They call for handball. Referee didn't want a bar of it. Rob Polistina into traffic. Play an advantage, says the referee. Ball to Rinaldi on the left. Checkers in the middle. Just goes past his head. That's where Kent Hurst are dangerous. You can see this play's opening up. There's a little bit more space for both sides in attack. Leroy. Checker with a touch, which is a nice touch because Ronaldo gets in behind Overton. Oh, ball! Should be. Can't be. Benello, great work from Cassantini again for Castle RSL in between the sticks. Oh, he's trouble. Those boys just better ease up a moment. Vukovic. I think Asani. Free kick goes the way of Kent Hurst. Everyone behind the ball for Castle Hill RSL. Flicked on by Geeky. Too big. Goal kick. Castle Hill RSL. Oh, that wasn't a great ball. Bangash did well for the Rockets. All red. Rockets have done well to win it back, but again, that just that final touch. A little heavy. Benello. Space on the right now for Kent Hurst. Torval. Cleared by Sean Overton. RSL throw. Now down to under five minutes of regulation time here in this first half. It's been an entertaining first half in around six of Hills Football Premier League. Men's around six match of the day. Bangash. Nowhere to go. 
Kentos go long again. Let's work this time. Bonello, back flick. Still a chance for Rinaldi. Rinaldi, can he shoot? Oh, yes, he does. Oh, yes. I'll have a double, says Edward Rinaldi. And that's a fine finish because he had not much room to work with. Cassantini thought he had it covered, but it was just too powerful a shot. And the Bush boys have hit the front. Kenthurst 2, Castle Hill RSL 1. And that's thrown a spanner in the works of this one. Edward Rinaldi, quality finish. Put some good work along there with Jordan Bonello. And now it's the Rockets who are behind the eight ball for the moment. Overton. Polistina into the middle. Bangash. Turn. Shot from Tuma. No power behind it. Not a problem for you mean. Couldn't be brought under control. Bonello on it for Kenthurst. They've tried that right hand side again where they've been quite successful. Here's Rob Polistina. Littlewood does well and actually keeps it in the field of play, which is brilliant work. Leroy. Then don't have to do anything silly here, Kent Hurst. Just hold possession. Into the middle. You mean... Safely there. Oh, that's not a good ball. Sama has swooped onto it. He, will he go one on one? He does. And it comes off his knee for a goal kick. There was a runner coming through the middle. Forty seconds of regulation time remaining here. <laughs> Tor will happy to just put it straight out. Summer on the turn. They won't win the throw. It's off the Rockets. Oh. Down to stoppages. So you mean won't be in any hurry. Flick on from Geeky. Torville. Of course, we did have a drinks break, so we'll have at least a minute. Maybe longer. Here's Benello. Leroy is making an overlapping run. He finds him. Leroy, good ball! Oh, it's gone to the legs. It's still in. No, it's not. It's all oh, hole happening in the area. 
Looked like the keeper missed it. There was a defender at the back post who couldn't clear. Did get a touch on it. Now, Cassantini's actually down. So we might just have some attention for him. He's all right. He's got up. Probably the last attacking chance of the half. Not a bad ball. And I'm bang on the mark because it's half time here at Valentine Sports Park for your round six. Hills Football Premier League match of the day men's competition. Half time, Kent Hurst. The Bush boys are up by two goals to one over Castle Hill, RSL Rockets. Please join us back in a few minutes time for all the second half action here on Hills Football Premier League.
Welcome back to Valentine Sports Park for this Round 6 Hills Football Premier League men's competition match of the day between Kenthurst Bush Boys and the Castle Hill RSL Rockets. We're at half time. The score was 2 1 in favour of the home side, Kenthurst. Samuel Hamilton that got the scoring underway for Castle Hill RSL in the 22nd minute. But an Ed Rinaldi double has seen the Bush boys take the lead as we just await for them to return to the park. My name is Dave McDonald. Hope you've been enjoying this entertaining match so far. Again, incredible weather conditions today after what we've had. I can understand to be a lot of frustrated footballers out there. Again, missing out. But we're blessed to get this game up and away here at the home of Football New South Wales. Again, Kent Hurst started off the stronger Castle RSL. Really found their way back into it. It was that second goal from Ed Rinaldi and Kent Hurst took back the ascendancy. And just waiting for the assistant and the Bush boys to come out. Already pushing time. So one substitution so far. Jaden Galanos replaced Sam Hamilton, the goal scorer. Unfortunately pulled up lame in a strong challenge. And a fine finish from him in the 22nd minute. Oh yeah, we're just waiting, still waiting. Quite sure what the hold up here is. Castle RSL have been waiting here for a little while now. Just a reminder tomorrow, a double header. Live first down Hills football. It's the community round match. Quarter past one, and then it'll be your women's Hills Football Premier League match of the day at three o'clock. But here come Kent Hurst. So we're almost to get about to have action back underway for this second half. Now we just need some referees. Still waiting for some referees. Obviously didn't get the memo we needed to get this game on time today. Officials have found their way through the tunnel. We're almost ready 
to get back underway. With Kent Hurst defending the southern end or the left hand of your screen. Peter Checker over the ball for them. And of course, Castle Hill RSL defending the northern end, the right of your screen in the white and blue. We're away with Kent Hurst. I'll go up. Ball goes astray, but the header goes loose to Geeky. For Kent Hurst, it'll be Torval. Nice dummy from Tassis. Tassis will switch. Bonello. Bonello looked to shoot. He looked to shoot and will get it on target. Unfortunately, not strong enough to bother Casentini. Who I might add has put off a couple of great saves for RSL. Another turnover. Checker. Good touch. Well read by Rockets. Falls for Kenthurst again. Turn inside there from Torval. Tassis. Strong defence on Bonello. Oh, no runner. And Tassis acknowledging that ball. It's just off on his heels a little bit there. Polistina for Squally. Finds his brother Rob. Sama. Polistina. With the shot. Just under it a little. No problem for Joseph Yamin. In the game it started off here 27 degrees at, the, at kickoff. Hard to fathom that after the weather we've had here in Sydney. You mean with the goal kick? Sama. Terranova, running out of options. Dalanos, now a little bit of space here for Pasquale Polistina. Oh, just couldn't find Tuma with the ball over the top. Another ball over the top, well read from Littlewood. Leroy's there to collect. Player still down for Castle Hill RSL. We'll come back to that in just a moment. He hasn't got up. Now, the referee has now stopped play. And will Castle Hill RSL have to go to their bench again? The referee just... Ordering Connor Overton off the field. We'll come all the way back. Now it should be a throw to Castle Hill RSL just inside their half. What happens? He might have had a, a boot blowout as well. The play will resume for the moment with Castle Hill man down. Sportsmanship there to hand the ball back. Turnover. It's one. Finds the skipper, Sean, 
Overton. Policino with the ball. Offside though was Matt Tuma. Clearly just took off too early. So Overton back on. As in Connor Overton. No injury, thankfully. It's a, definitely a boot blowout. Leroy finds Bonello. Tries to turn inside. Nutmeg. He looked to shoot. Looked to shoot. Did it get a touch? It did. Passantini again called into action. So a corner for the Bush boys from the northeastern corner here of VSP2. Be Ronaldi has got to himself so far. Ball into the far post. Bonello couldn't bring it down. Goal kick. Santini happy to go short to Overton. Terranova earns the throw. Manos. Ball turned over. Checker now looks up. Got no runners on his outside. So he goes towards the inside. It wasn't a bad ball. Just too big for Benello. Ronaldi was coming through in the far post, but just two or three paces behind. Now here's Holostina. Place on the right now for the Rockets. Deflected, but no problem for Yamin. I didn't look up. Terranova was making a good run down the left and had some space. Defensive header from the skipper. Now Bonello. Ronaldi, oh nice, nice touches again between the two shoots and into action again is Cassantini. Oh, that looked pretty good from Bonello. And yet again, Cassantini full stretch saves the day for the Rockets. So it's quickly taken. RSL unaware. Leroy with the ball. To the back post. Headed in by Farrell. Now Rockets. Quickly clear. And Sama with some space. Pasquale Polistina. To his brother. Nice delivery. Nice control. Now need options. Sama's there. Sama turns. But he's got no other options. Found Polistina again. Now Sama. Don't let him shoot from there. Luckily he couldn't get any power behind it. Ronaldi. Lord over to Torval. It's 
Torval now, sorry. It's Farrell. Checker coming back. Good little dart from Geeky through. Oh, just couldn't put, could not put his foot on it, Benello. Otherwise, he could have been in a good position. Sweep it out to the left. Galanos with the ball. Polistina was beaten off the ball and then committed the foul. Bergovic for Kent Hurst. As you see that sun now dropping down to that unbearable height. That's the far post. Headed on and yet again he is caught into play. Casentini. Again, hard to tell from this angle looking into the sun whether that was going to curl inside that net. But G's been good today. He's kept his side in it. But still more work to do here for him because it'll be Ed Rinaldi with the corner. To the edge of the six. Farrell gets ahead on it. Couldn't bring it down. Safely a goal kick. Move it quickly. Bangash. Samus free on the left. If they can find him, which they do. He's got one in front of him. Now, can he shoot? Again, that's a dangerous position. But he hasn't been able to get behind one yet. of time at the back for Kent Hurst. Torval. Safely done by Overton. Terranova. Nice work. He's beaten two. Will he try to send Sama through? Sama's on side. Can Sama finish? He does! Oh, they're back in it. He's had three or four shots and he hasn't had the best of days. But he knows where to be at the right time. It's all even here. Kenthurst 2, Castle Hill, RSL 2. Be a substitution. No, it won't be. <laughs> Looking like Torval was going to come off, but I think they've had to change their mind because Farrell looks like he is looking at a little ginger. <laughs> so. Kenthurst's first substitution. Number six, Andrew Luttringer. Into the fray for the Bush boys. And he's straight on the ball. Yeah, I think Alex Torval thought he was coming off there for a moment. Leroy. Vukovic with the ball checker now. Tassis. Oh, the ball from Ronaldi couldn't get through. No, that was actually um, Lutteringer. A couple of similar haircuts between Ronaldi 
Luttringer there, and even Peter Checker. Now, Polistina on the left-hand side wasn't a great ball to his brother, intercepted. Return ball, just couldn't hold it, just a little strong. Galanos almost got the return pass. Ronaldi gets the return touch. Peter Checker and another return touch. Now he goes to shoot and just over the top. Oh, going for a hat trick. But he's so dangerous on the ball. And some great one two touching there from the Bush boys in their front third. Now 15 minutes gone in this second half. Sama, strong. They move it left quickly. Well, they decide against it there with Terranova. And they turn it over. The ball has come off Castle Hill, according to the officials. Check up. Tassis got in there to take the rebound and earns the free kick. Bangash not overly impressed with that decision. And kicked away. Silly from Polistina. Pasquale Polistina goes into the referee's book. A tight one here at VSP. Bugovic. Castle Hill clear. Summer's touch wasn't strong enough. Sama is beautiful from Sama. Now here's Rob Polistina. Nice turn inside. Polistina with the shot. It was bang on target. But you mean didn't have to move. Check up. Well, he's sending Tassis for a run. Just a little heavy. Bangash back to Waverton. A little bit of pressure on here because Ronaldo's chasing. And gives away a free kick for the challenge from behind. Bangash to Terranova. Terranova trying to send it long. Well read, Littlewood. And Sama now, he's got a spring in his step now. He's put one away. And again, six back for Kent Hurst. Torval now. A little bit of space in front of him. Looking for an option. Nothing in front of him. Bit of a nothing ball. No runners. Bangash, plenty of time. Polistina to Sama. Sama over the top offside though. Tuma. They've held the defensive line well and caught them offside a few times. Kethurst. Leroy. Watering up. Tassus. Plenty of room. Watering up. For Peter Vukovic. Vukovic 
Gets into the area. Leroy. Not a great ball. Taken quickly, but going across goals, not necessarily the smartest option. Fangash. Nearly a turnover. That was pretty much all he could do there, Polistina. Torval now. Sending Tassis. Hosseini's there. Now, what that is that going to be? Corner. Remonstrating with the assistant, asking for a penalty or a free kick. Might have just been outside the area anyway. But they'll still get an opportunity to attack. And Ed Rinaldi with another corner. As we approach the halfway mark of this second half. Good grab, Cassantini. And he sends immediately Rob Polistina away. He's got Luttringer in front of him. Luttringer's got to be careful. Strong challenge. Falls for Sama, though, who immediately switches to the left with Terranova. Has a shot. Can't bring it down. Looked up, Pasquale Polistina had made a run to the left and was free. Right. Who's going to be the next to crack here? Still feel like there's another one to come in this match. Overton with a head. Might not be able to keep that in. And it's taken quickly by Torval. Geeky. Gets it back from Littlewood. Turn, but... Strong work from Castle Hill. Sama will switch across to the right, but again, power in numbers for Kent Hurst. Ronaldi earns the free kick, uh, the throw in, should I say. Torval with the throw. Oh. Peter Check is coming for it. Does not get there first. Tuma. Looking for somewhere to go. Back from Terranova. Again, defensive line. Holding for Kenthurst. Flick on, but again, plenty of white shirts. Latringer did well to spot that little gap. Bonello. Bonello, he's got pace. Can he get the ball inside? He nearly did, but it was blocked by Sean Overton. Another corner for Kent Hurst. We approach 20 minutes of regulation time remaining. Delivery to the edge of the six. Straight on to the head of Bonello, who's 
Put it straight into the bread basket of Cassantini. This time of the match with those chances are just going to be so vital. Plenty of pressure coming through. Sama strong. Polistina square. Terranova. Offside though is Polistina. Not happy with that call. RSL bench up in arms about that one. Assistant bang on the mark. Bonello couldn't control the pass from Ronaldi. Now we might see a change here for Castle Hill. Or no, or is it drinks? Oh. Oh. 71 minutes gone, 19 minutes remaining in this match, plus stoppages. Feel the pressure, it's a tense one today. Two all currently. It's been a good old battle this one. I've got to say so far, Anthony Cassantini has been a star in goals for the Rockets. He's pulled off some wonderful saves. Again, still plenty of questions from the RSL side. Once the decision's made, it's made. A lesson for all kids. The referee is always right. So, we'll have play resume with 13, uh, 17 minutes of regulation remaining, plus a couple of minutes of stoppages. The sun's disappeared, but it's still hot out in the middle. So, is it going to be all or nothing? Matthew Leroy with the throw to restart play. Look over the top checker trying to get there. But does use his hands in that one and the referee is bang on the spot. Coming through. Lateral up to Leroy. Checker who's done a lot of hard work. Geeky. With a bit of space. Going for a run. There was Torval, but couldn't bring it under control. 
Terranova with the ball through. That could be a little issue. And it will be a yellow card for Matthew Geeky. Deliberately held the man back. Right. One each in the book. Right. Terranova will be over the ball. comes in it's not a bad one Overton just couldn't get the head on it but he made the perfect run now it's Peter Checker for Kent Hurst Lutringer up beats one good turn Vukovic Rinaldi oh Rinaldi nearly got it back Free kick. Summer into the back of Lutringa. He's a big man, Summer. Second short. Torville with the ball. Hosseini got a head on it first. Able to clear. Had a man to nothing, unfortunately, from Tuma. Although, Yamin's had to come out of his area and will give away a throw. Still 13 minutes to go. One goal in these next 13 minutes could be a decider. Leroy with the head. And another one from Vukovic. A check up. Nearly a turnover, and it is, in fact. Good work from Tuma to get it back to Polistina. Terranova. Look left, he's got Rob Polistina free. Finds him. Ball in. Might have, did, it, did it get a deflection? No, says the referee. Bonello. Check his head up. Didn't quite go where he intended. To me. Okay. Much movement off the ball at the moment for Kenthurst. Happy to sit and hold for the moment. Torval. Rockets keeping their flat back four at the moment. Cheeky there from Littlewood. Leroy. Shot. Not a bad effort from there from Benello. But not a problem for Anthony Casentini. But that wasn't a great clearance. Vukovic, his ball went astray. Rob Polistina now for Rockets. With a tussle there. Into the back of Matt Tuma. So here, 
earn the free kick. We're going to see a substitution for Kent Hurst. Thirty-nine coming on. Get to that in a moment. It's Paul Tassis that has a spell. I'll come back to that substitute in a moment because. RSL are on the attack. Sam are looking to hold it up and turn the shoot. No free kick, says the referee. That looked like a fair challenge for mine. But I'm up in the stand. Well won from Tuma. Terranova. Free kick. Referee having a quiet word to Andrew Luttringer. Adam Amico is the substitution on for Kenthurst in number 39. That'll be Francesco Terranova. He's going to have a dart from there, and I tell you, that's. Pretty close. But those chances are going to be few and far between as we head towards the end of regulation time, which is now eight and a half minutes away. Strong from Hosseini. Well, flick from Polistina to Terranova. Not a bad one. Toom is coming through. Cleared by Amico. Caught into action straight away. Terranova has a shot. Tell you what, not a bad one. Was going to swing outside the post, though. You mean happy to, to grab it and send his team on their way. Leroy, nice ball to Checker. Checker goes through. Ronaldi couldn't get there. And funnily enough, he's opposite number 13, the goalkeeper. <laughs> we'll let that over for a goal kick. Full of action this one today. It's been a great clash. It might not be over yet. Polistina. Switch across to Terranova. He'll switch it back to the left to Polistina. Torval. Did well. Lutteringer clears. It is out. Still a scramble for the ball in the middle. Pass from Checker. Vukovic goes square to the left. Amico to Leroy. 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 Wide. Not a problem. Lights on here at Valentine Sports Park. It's been an absolutely cracking day. It's fallen nicely for Rob Polistina. Torval's got plenty to do. And sees the free kick. Uh, the, the throw in, should I say. Sama turns. Now he'll look to shoot if he can. Terranova's lined up for the shot. The pressure came through from Littlewood. He sprayed his shot right.
Are uh, we going to find a winner this afternoon? Both sides giving it all. Saini pulls back for RSL. Langash. Iverton. That falls well. For Tuma, who's got a bit of space to shoot. It's blocked. Falls back for Polistina. Some good work from Amico on the left. Important dispossession he made there. Check up. Did well. Bring it under control. And find his teammate. Amico's ball was intercepted. Would have been questionable whether Leroy was on side or not. Three and a half of regulation to go. Ronaldi. Did he earn the corner? No. It was off him, so it'll be a goal kick. Quickly taken to Polistina, who's going to struggle to keep it under control. Again. Sure about that from Polistina. <laughs> Lutteringer. With Leroy. Ronaldi's touch back to Leroy. Leroy! Oh, Checkers put it left. Oh, that could have been the one. But a little, it was a collision from the defender that made him go to the left, I believe. It was almost. The perfect opportunity, but I think he just got a nudge right at the end there. Right. Anthony Yacoub entering the field for the Rockets. And it looks like Connor Overton is off on the far side. He looks like he's got a problem. Lutteringer for Kent Hurst. The chase is on. Matt Toomer's quick. Matt Toomer into the area. Can he finish? Oh, he's just gone strong. Now that should be a free kick. No, it's a goal. That was a clear push in the back for mine. But the goal stands. There's nothing the assistant referees can do. But I'd already looked the other way because I presumed it had been cleared, but the goal stands. It's Castle Hill RSL 3, Kenthurst 2. Some late controversy here at Valentine Sports Park. So. Three tilt remains. Play it down. Still, uh, that'll be the end of the afternoon by the look of it. Right. 
Kenhurst can't believe it. Well, this game's had it all this afternoon. It's been a crack up. Scaloni on for the Rockets. We're into injury time. All right. Play resumes. Kent Hurst, can they get one back? Free kick. Kent Hurst, need to move quickly. Still plenty of chat between the fourth official and the bench. Comes into the middle. Cleared. It's not over yet. One minute of injury time played. Probably got another two to go. Ball is intercepted. Bonello through. Can Leroy get there? Leroy does. He turns inside. He shoots. It's blocked. Bonello! Jordan Bonello says, no way we're giving away the points this afternoon. That's a fine finish. That's three all. Well, what an afternoon this has been. 3-3. Three, three. I said there'd be plenty more and I wasn't wrong. What a game of football this has been. I'll tell you what, if the points were to be shared, that wouldn't be a bad thing. In my view, it's been a good performance from both sides. And some quality finishes. Uh, it's all in the referee's hands as we speak. Turnover. Sama's on it. They need to clear and they do so. Now Benello's there. Now, here's an opportunity. Ken Kenhurst put away a winner. Oh, it goes past Ronaldi's outstretched leg. Now, Sama. Sama's got him in a headlock, almost. And I think the referee will... Oh, she's given them both one, in fact. So, not over yet. <laughs> Polistina with the free kick. Got to be only seconds remaining here. Squally Polistina. Turn over over the top. Sama, it falls to. Kendo is happy to clear. And there we have it. Full time here at Valentine Sports Park. Round six match of the day. It's all even. What a cracking game. Three all. Kenhurst three. Castle RSL three. Join us tomorrow for all the women's Premier League action and the community round. I'm Dave McDonald. Have a great weekend.